Hello friends and welcome to Life is Strange. This is my first ever YouTube Let's Play playthrough thingy so bear with me if I'm a little off. Uh, I've decided to play Life is Strange. I played it once before but never really got very far and I really wanted to try it out properly this time so I thought it would be a good excuse to start up my gaming channel with this and see if it's something that I enjoy doing. Um, we're just starting a brand new clean slate. So we'll see how it goes. This is a game where your decisions make the story, if you've heard of that kind of thing before. Good, if not, um, we'll see if you get into it, and if I get into it. There we go. Play a choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely! We'll see if I do choose wisely. There we go. Guys, you okay there? Yeah, good. It's fine. Where am I? What's happening? Good question. I'm trapped in a storm. How did I get here? And where is here? Where is here indeed? I love Wait, that. There's a lighthouse. On the hair. I'll be safe if I can make it there. Okay, a lighthouse. Please let me make it there. Oh, is that my job then? Okay, fine. Uh, this is pretty tense. I'm not sure about the controls really yet. Uh, but we'll see. It's the lighthouse. Wow. God. This way? Yeah. Holy shit. That doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. What happened here? Let's see if we can get past all kinds of apocalypse things. So surreal. Famously called oh, film yeah, little was. pieces of time. So now we're but he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. Uh, ten to four. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light Is everything cool? to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Mm. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't and fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Weird Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Oh, because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Like totally haunted. She saw humanity as tortured, right? Oh. And frankly, How it's bullshit. Like, ah. shh, 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 shh. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Mm, a bit paranoid there. I don't know, man. It's not great, but it's not bad. Either. Keep that it's to yourself. Cute. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Uh, and any one of you. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? That you're pretty cute. <laughs> I'm not sure if I should do this. Um, it's gonna take a while, isn't it? Okay, so we have the people. Um, this is Max. So this is us, I guess. This is the teacher. Uh, this is the girl who's so totally haunted. Um, this is the girl that just got like a paper ball thrown at her face. Um, I'm not gonna read all of this to you now. It looks like she just. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh god, this is a lot. Okay, so she's just started a new school. She's really excited about it. She's studying photography. 
Um, I'm just really looking forward to going back to Arcadia Bay. Oop, what did I do? That was not... That was not... Oh. Um, okay, she's leaving Seattle. Yeah, Arcadia Bay, exactly. Okay, and... Um, she has a crush on her teacher, Mark Jefferson is his name, Mr. Jefferson. And um, she had a friend here that she kind of drifted away from. Her name was Chloe. Sure, we can work with this. She is crazy here. I was just about to say I kind of like her. She spelled crazy with a K. Not so sure anymore there, Max. Maybe that's a bit... Maybe like, you should reevaluate your, your life choices, maybe, a little bit. Um... <laughs> Okay, so no one will know me except for Chloe, and who knows how different we are now. I feel like that might be kind of important to the story, just putting that out there. Um, but she's really excited about her photography, she's moving moving up in the world, she's... Okay, now she's not too happy about her new dorm and her new classmates dorm mates, everyone's terrible and bitchy and judgmental. Typical high school in America then, I guess. Um, she doesn't really want to complain about it too much, um, because she still loves Mr. Jefferson and that just makes it all worth it, apparently. Half load of homework, blah 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 blah. I thought being 18 meant I didn't have to deal with this teenage drama anymore, I thought. Oh, you thought wrong, apparently, there, Max. OMG, I want to marry him. She's a bit intense about the teacher crush there. Not sure how I feel about that. Homework is kicking my ass. I, you know, I can identify with this when I was at, well, my equivalent of high school. Things were pretty bad. It's not a great, not a great place. There's lots of backstory here. Um, I feel like we might pick up on this if we just play the game. I'm usually someone who reads everything, so this is very untypical, but I'm feeling the pressure of my first Let's Play here and I don't want to spend too much time reading everything. Don't mind me just taking a sip of my tea. Um, okay, let's get back to class, shall we? I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer oh, God, Robert I can't Frank. Listen. Can't listen to her. I'm me gonna too, take Victoria. A selfie. He captured the essence of post-war beat America. And there was honesty about the economic... Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A oh, dumb well. word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Okay. And Max has a gift. Really? Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation That's was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry. Yeah, you I should be resist. sorry. The point remains that Mr. the portraiture has Jefferson. always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Okay. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Oh, God. Uh, uh, you're asking me? How rude. Okay, we'll go with, I did know. I did know. But I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Oh, Louis no, Daguerre was intense. a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. What a bitch. <laughs> Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, Ooh. making them extremely popular from the that? 1800s onward. That was a sick the first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. Oh. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out okay. with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, <laughs> get it don't together, hide. Stella I'm still Alyssa. waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Um, he's a bit, he's a bit rude. Okay, so, oh. Yes, Victoria, completely Victoria doesn't, doesn't waste a second thing. kissing ass. Photo for the competition, everybody. Ugh, class literally. Photo, oh, so I can take a photo. You see the dilemma? Cool. I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard on the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like. Say, I'm the prep. Right. 
Rachel, I just um, really forever. think everyday heroes is an important sure. cultural event. I could event. submit that to the and contest, I, I guess. You, you have just by participating, oh, by putting yeah. yourself out there in the world. You, was it? Now, no matter who wins, hi Kate. This is just a bump oh. along the road. Hi Max. I don't want anybody to feel excluded She's from this cute. process, but uh, I also want everybody to know that this what? photographic right. world is quite not You seem quiet I today. Just thinking too much. Everybody oh. should touch I only right. want to share whatever gives me yes, I hear that. Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Who doesn't? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Uh, okay. I want to be my friend. <laughs> I mean, what? <laughs> I'm not embarrassing myself. You said I was embarrassing myself. Can I just can I just leave? I don't really want to interfere with this whole ass kissing thing that's going on here. Maybe I can just get the fuck out of here. But I see you, Max Caulfield. Shit. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Okay, fine. I'd Is never this? let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Are you serious? I feel like he's patronizing me. I don't like it. Um, I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. It's not a lie. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I life. know it's a drag to hear some <laughs> old dude lecture you. Yeah. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. So he's not now, being patronizing. Uh, all you need no. is no. the courage to share your gift with others. And that's oh, what separates the it. artist from the amateur. She digs it so much. Okay, whatever. I'm leaving. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have you to always Welcome to the real world. Just cute? Huh. Then I might send you a special picture. Ugh. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. Just she plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Um. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. Yeah, splash water on your face, the whole shebang. That seems like a good She's so plan fucking for an intro scene. There we go. These are the people we have to find for this game. And those kind of cool graphics, like I really like it. I know my computer can't deal with them that well. Um, it just has that style, you know, it's different. Okay, interactive intro scene. Oh, oh, we can look at people. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. What about Alyssa? She needs to get it together. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Internet friends. What well, that's called. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother looking at these people. <laughs> not nice. Be part of the world Poor Daniel, he's so nice. Driving I wish I could beat the shit out of the Logan. Maybe shit? the shit out of Logan. Brooke, looks kind of nice. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Whoa. Um, rude. Oh. It looks like she's been gone for months. To all of you, Rachel Amber, American okay. girls in oh, movies. No one can Maybe tell we'll find out more about this. American girls like dollies with shiny smiles and close to buddy. Um, oh, toilet. I was right. I like that skeleton there. Splash water on her face, shall we? Girlfriend. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. I like that song. <sighs> this is cool as shit. Like, wow, I really like this game. Rachel Amber is a bitch. I can't take a picture of this. Now who would bother to write that crap? Well, especially since she's missing. The Lemonati. Lemonati. 
This poster must drive people to have sex. Abstinence makes the heart grow fonder. You can still love and learn without sex. Time is on your side. So is common sense. Use it. And then it just says, Kate twerks for God. Sure. Wh whatever. Whatever, man. Wait, Kate? Wasn't Kate the girl who didn't want to have tea with us? Maybe she just isn't isn't into tea. Um, what? I'm gonna... She just prefers twerking. She didn't seem like the type there really, did she? Um, okay. Let's, let's do the actual water splashing, shall we? Getting sidetracked here. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Yeah, our teacher said so. Fuck it. No. 